Hi, my name is Susan Khalil, and I'm an assistant professor at the Icon School of Medicine in the Department of Obstetrics and Gynecology, and specifically in the Division of Minimally Invasive Gynecologic Surgery. So, so there's many uh, factors that can affect your menstrual cycle, um, from stress to different changes in your physical activity, to weight changes and other medical conditions that, that can be fairly common. Um, but, but there hasn't been any uh, uh, studies or reports at this time, at least, um, for how it can directly impact your menstrual cycle changes. Um, th there's some concern that I'm sure is um, at this time about changes that can happen uh, to the menstrual cycle where it's either heavier or lighter, but there's so many different factors. So it's something that is definitely worth exploring if it comes up as a concern. So if there are any irregularities, meaning that you have more bleeding than usual, less bleeding than usual, it it's an opportunity to really uh, see your gynecologist and establish care or look into what the reason is for this uh, change. Um, and it really offers a nice opportunity to see if there's another uh, factor that's implicated in this, um, even if it's something that's unlikely a long-term impact, uh, but something that's short-term. So it's definitely an op a window for, for really trying to get to the bottom of what's going on. Currently on the CDC's website and, and through the American College of Obstetrics and Gynecologists, it, there are no recommendations against uh, getting vaccinated during this period. But my recommendation to my patients is usually if it's something that causes you anxiety or to get more worried about it, then you, you may want to do it at a different time if there is that opportunity. But I can't emphasize enough how vaccination is very important. And it's something that this shouldn't bar you from, from doing this. Um, so, so that, that's just my recommendation on that. And, but again, any changes in menstrual cycle or something where it, it presents as an opportunity to explore it with your gynecologist.